Okay, take two. Um, hello there, Fellowship of the Rye, Harvey here. Um, Try to make a very response to Jay's um, previous follow-up about happiness. And somehow, sometimes my phone is out of sync sound and, and video. Let's see if this time it's better without the AC on and the fan and all the possible background noise that I can reduce. Um, uh, the housekeeping. Um, I'm smoking my lovely Golden Gate. Uh, this is a Ukrainian pipe which I really like. Mm, as this is a very response to Jay. Mm. And and I forgot to 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 mention again that uh, my apologies. My videos uh, have recently become way too long because I'm I'm recording with my phone, and in doing so. Um, not be able to see what's the time, so I, I'm just put it to run a stopwatch in my computer, so I know that I'm close to one minute twenty or so. Mm. So Jay, first of all, I'm hurt. Mm. I'm hurt because Jay is a person that usually, when you comment, when you make a thoughtful comment in one of his videos, he will take the time to reply to it, which is very similar to what I do. And in this video that I'm replying to, he he asked the question that it, if it would be possible to have um, if happiness is the abs is is not having problems basically. And and I, I thought I, I I had a pretty good comment there, and I didn't have any re re reply. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> Mm, but in all seriousness, when uh, when I got to think about when when I saw your video, the first thought that came to mind was a book that I read uh, when I was like uh, fourteen or thirteen years old, and I remember that because um, I rarely read books cover to cover. and And this book was um, a self help book, which is even more rare. Uh, by an author um, called Leo Buscaglia, and and he addressed that that issue. I remember clearly. So when I look up in internet to find a quote related to that, I couldn't. But in the process, I found a quote from another author of similar books. Um, no surprise there. Uh, the author is called H. Jackson Jack Brown Jr. And he says, and I quote: "Happiness is not the absence of problems, but the ability to deal with them." And I think that summarizes what I think. You need the ups and downs so you can be able to recognize, to acknowledge that you are happy. Although my very personal definition of happiness, as I shared before, was this um, calm, this state of mind of being in peace. Mm. But you need to have those. You need to have those ups and downs. Otherwise, you wouldn't, you wouldn't know. What I could read between the lines, and I'm not sure if actually that what that was exactly Jay's question was: if is it possible to be happy while you are having that problem, when you're facing the challenge, when you when you just find out, when you are just uh, stressed uh, because of a a problem that you you will have to deal with. No doubt, uh, dealing with it will be the key of happiness, and that opens the door, and that's that's the way it leads the way to happiness. But is it possible to be happy while you're having a problem, while you're in despair? And and I would say no. I would say that that will be extremely challenging. Perhaps it's not impossible, but it will be near near to impossible to 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 have this ability to overcome the stress right right on right right there right on the spot and and achieve or attain happiness given those situations. Okay, I'm closing to five minutes, and that's my limit. As always, my friends, puff away.